Hey guys, Damners here, and today we'll be doing what happens when we put a foreign disc in a Nintendo Wii. It's been a while since I did a foreign disc video, guys. I did did foreign disc videos back in the past. So first up, the try for Wii game works. I got Game Party 2. This game should work. Actually, I did move move my disc channel. As you get, as you can see, the game works. See that works. Now let's go to the Nintendo games since this is Nintendo's console. We have Sonic Mega Collection for the GameCube. This should work as it the Nintendo Wii is backwards compatible with GameCube games. Since I don't have a GameCube controller, so Oh, did I put it in the wrong way? Yeah, I did put it in the wrong way. I put it in the wrong way, guys. Sorry about that. There we go. We have Nintendo GameCube. Man, that sound is awesome. So, you can play GameCube on your Wii. That's nice. Now, the next game we have Super Mario 3D World for the Wii U. I don't know how, I'm really interested about this one because it's going to show me an error message. Unable to read the disc. So you can't play Wii games on the Wii. Really sad. Now let's move on to the PlayStation games. First we have is Resident Evil 2 for the PlayStation 1. Unable to read the disc. Next, let's try the PlayStation 2 game, Resident Evil 4. So this is a fun game if you have it. It's rated M, so you can't play it until you're like, how many, what years old? 17. You can't play this game until 17 years old. Unable to read the disc. Next, let's try placing in three game Sports Champions 2. I feel really interested about this one because this is a Blu ray disc. I'm pretty sure the Wii is not going to recognize it. As you can see, he's making a weird noise. It's not going to read. It's going to show a black screen of death of the errors occurred message. An error has occurred. Press the eject button, remove the disc, and turn off the Wii console off. And further, Wii operations may open more help in total shooting. So you can't. So Blu-ray discs can show this error message on your Wii. And let's turn off the console. Power back on. Wii 
when you're still working. As you can see, the Wii is still working. Alright, that's for the PlayStation games. We have Minecraft PS4 Edition for the PS4. I feel that's the same thing as happening on the PS3 game. It's going to do it again. Yep, it's making the same noise. How you guys like my Toshibo TV? It's really nice. And an errors occur if I see jump button remove the disc. So you can't play PS4 games on the Wii. Since I don't have a PS5 game, so because the PS5 is really expensive and I don't have a PS5 game, I'm pretty sure the Wii is going to do the same thing to the PS3 and PS4 game. Got my Wii controller. The Wii is still working. Alright, that's enough for the PlayStation games. Let's go to the Xbox games. We have Halo 2 for the original Xbox. Maybe we might get something lucky about this one because this is it. So in my last four in this video, this showed like a DVD video of the Xbox splash screen or something. I forget, I think it's a, like, it says this is an Xbox game disc or something. I am able to read the disc again. Next, let's try an Xbox 360 game. Madden NFL XX series or Madden NFL XX years. I forget what it's called. There's actually two discs. And I'm going to try disc one. This can also play DVD video too. I'm able to read the disc. I'm not even going to try disc 2 because it's probably going to do the same thing. That's not much of the games. Let's move on. Let's try DVD. We have Marduk for the DVD. I love this movie. It's a really great movie. If you ever seen it, let me know. I don't know if the Wii can play DVDs. That's just sad. I can't believe the Wii can't play DVDs. That was my favorite thing, if the Wii can play DVDs. The PS2 and PS3 and PS4 can play DVDs. Same with the Xbox and Xbox 360. and X Not the original Xbox, Xbox One and Xbox 360 can play DVDs. Now let's try Blu-ray. Got the Simpsons movie for Blu-ray. I feel a little bit interested about this one too because this is a Blu-ray disc. It's probably going to do the same thing to PS3 and PS4. It's not making the weird noise. I am able to read the disc. Okay. Somehow that didn't work that time like the PS3 and PS4 did. Last but not least, got a computer disc. Canon PIXMA MG2500. Okay. This is a CD-ROM for Windows. This is actually from my printer over there. It's actually from my printer. Got it out. Let's see if it works. That made a weird sound. I'm able to read the disc. That's sad. 
can't recognize a, win a computer disk. Always sad. Alright guys, I actually have one more thing I want to show you guys. Let's try some money before I go. We gotta try a $10 bill. See if we'll recognize. Let me fix it a little bit because it's kind of co-opted. You know what? I'm gonna get a different $10 bill. I'll be right back. Let's forget it. We're just gonna insert it. So I cannot recognize a dollar. Really sad. Wanted to add money to my Wii account. Well guys, that's going to be pretty much it of my foreign disc video. What happens when you put a foreign disc in the Wii. If you have a Nintendo Wii, please let me know. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. And, goodbye everybody.